Hi guys, Hyperlative here, the Norwegian gamer. What I'm bringing you this time is some gameplay from the uh, new extension to Bad Company 2. So this is Battlefield Bad Company 2 Vietnam. Uh, this is a um, this is the first uh, proper DLC slash extension we've had to uh, or expansion pack rather we've had to. Um, Bad Company 2. We've had some new maps, but mostly it's been um, uh, new game modes on old maps. So it's been kind of um, uh, kind of a half-assed DLC we've gotten this so far. So this is really awesome. Um, uh, the expansion or DLC, whatever you want to call it, is multiplayer only. So there's no new campaign to go through or something like that. But at least we've got some new maps, uh, the same game modes of course, but we've got new maps, we got new weapons, and we've got new vehicles. And of course we've also got some awesome music from the era. So we got some real good classic rock um, playing in some of the vehicles, like the cars and tanks often have a radio so you can actually listen to songs while driving. It's, it's actually quite awesome. So, this is... Oh, I can't remember the map name. <laughs> well, anyways. Uh, this is, um, as you might uh, figure out, one of the new maps. And I'm oh, running with the... Um, yeah, if you hear that voice, that's actually me. I uh, wasn't <laughs> I wasn't aware that I was recording. And when I'm playing, I always talk to myself. So... <laughs> I wasn't aware that I was actually recording my, what I was saying. Well, anyways, um, I'm running with the recon class with the Thompson uh, because I have to work on the recon class, but I'm not much of a sniper, so I just pick up this uh, MW2 or I mean, of course, WW2 Thompson SMG because um, it's actually quite good. If um, you know how to use it. Uh, the reason I haven't been posting anything the last few days is because I'm at home for Christmas at my mom and dad's. I usually um, I study away, so for Christmas I um, oh, I accidentally hit the uh, melee button. Um. I'm actually home for Christmas at my mom and dad, so I had to uh, I had to send my gaming computer through the postal service. So it took a few days because it was over the weekend, so I had to wait for the whole Saturday and Sunday because I don't uh, send anything those days. So I finally got my computer, and now I'm happily gaming again and could at la uh, at last try out Vietnam because we PC gamers we got it at the um, at the 18th instead of the 21st, but I couldn't uh, couldn't try it out before now because of me not having the computer. I can't promise that I'll um, upload many uh, a lot of videos while I'm at home. I have to s I have to see how it works out because um, I. Um, I'm not sure how many plans I'm gonna, I'm gonna, gonna have. Uh, <coughs> I'm sorry, I'm just watching. Uh, I'm not sure how many plans I'm gonna have. Uh, you know, I got some friends back here. This is where I grew up, after all, and it's kind of fun to see them again because I can't can't get to see them much when I um, I'm away at <coughs> studying at college. So. I mean, this is really awesome. I I really like the uh, the Vietnam setting. It re it's really fitting. It's really fitting. And of course, you got the new flamethrower. I haven't tried it out myself because um I don't get that much up close. But it's a re it's it's actually quite effective. If you meet a fl flamethrower guy, you'll be set on fire and you'll use lose a lot of health. Although it's not that effective as you might think, because he actually has to um he actually. He actually has to use 
on you for a while for you to die, but you'll you'll lose a lot of health. Uh, so I'm guessing the flamethrower guys get a lot of assists or cri critical assists. But um, I'm um, and of course the ta tanks also have a new flamethrower uh, weapon which you can choose from the. The uh, weapon, uh, vehicle specialisa specialization. Well, oh, that was a difficult word. It's uh, <laughs> I've just I've just uh, gotten up, so it's morning. So yeah. Can I just say how much I love the th the Thompson with the uh, Magnum uh, uh, Magnum ammo? It's really awesome. It kills in um, and not that many shots. Like, I don't want to say how many. Because I've taken people down with less than ten shots at time, but you don't you don't really know how much health they have all the time. So, but you, if if you're um if you're um conservative, you can actually get uh I would say three people in one mag. That's not too bad for an SMG. And the best part is, of course, that you can use it with all the classes. So what I'm doing here is actually running from C over to A because no one's at A. All uh, everyone is just trying to get to get or defend B. So I'm here all by myself taking um, A, and then some of my buddies spawn on me, or as I like to say, crawl out of my ass. So I, I'm trying to um, flank them on B, and this guy is <laughs> trying to kill me with his pistol. Not very effectively though. So I'm running up uh, behind on B here. Um, trying to hide in, in these bushes, and it's just a little too late when I hear this guy. No, not this guy. When I hear this guy coming up, and he kills me with his LMG. <laughs> so we've um. We've managed to keep A actually, and I'm pushing up on B again. Because I know we're, we've lost. I guess we're having like seven tickets left or something like that, and they have uh, over a hundred. So we've pretty much lost, anyways. But, you know, to make any last effort. This is actually quite awesome. Uh, you, you have a radio broadcast, or the news broadcast, I realize, which tells about the battle. It's quite awesome. Hope to see you next time. Snackers.